cool. Benny? I don't understand what's happening. Is this... There's no way in hell this, this is hell. hell. Okay, that's a new one. Yeah, you can say that again. This is the darkness, isn't it? It's some kind of trick. Come on, Jackie, don't start talking about that stuff again, okay? The darkness isn't real. It's just in your mind. What? I'm sorry, but I know you get confused by all this. These bad dreams are a part of being sick. You gotta help us get you well again. I'll tell you what. You go by the dispensary before breakfast, and I'll tell the doc you had a good night. Uh... Are you us all? Even you! I'm not even supposed to be here! Just calm down, Mr. Walker. 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 What Seems the fuck familiar. Is happening to me? Security. There's no way in hell you're security. Security would answer up. Smart ass. I was gonna say security would answer the phone, you prick. Just as I go to say it. Hey. Is that? No, he's been a sweetheart. He goes up and down, but he does well if I'm patient with him. It can be confusing for him at times. I want to do some displacement therapy with him. I'll set something up. Let That's Jenny, isn't it? Cycle. Okay. I can't get confirmation, but that's definitely her. I'm concerned he's regressed into a more complex cognitive disorder. Hi, yes. His thoughts are becoming I'm extremely disorganized. Let's try close it for a while. According to the evaluation, he had a problem with his white cell count. Wouldn't that suggest a more atypical approach? We'll take regular samples. Assuming he stays the course, we'll try to restart his therapy. He'll be encouraged once he gets back into the program. I'll speak. Hey, Jackie. I got the thing you wanted. It's big. Johnny, talk to me. What is all this? Some kind of darkness trick? That's what I told them, but they wouldn't believe me. They got bad wrists from all the computers. I tried to get your rocket in here, but it was too big. Rocket? That's why I don't go outside no more. Johnny, you gotta help me get out of here. You think there's some kind of secret key to everything, Jackie? It's Tuesday. You take your medicine and then you get your meatloaf. Meatloaf? God what the hell? It. I don't feel right in my head. I think I'm not alone. It's too bright here. Damn right it's too bright. Because something's going to happen. It'll all be clear in the end. Can you see straight? I can't see straight. Well, there I is something like fucked up with bends. your eyes. And sometimes it goes around corners. Well, you do have a couple he fucked up eyes. He's on the 10 yard line. He breaks the tackle. 20 yard line. 30, 40, 50, 60, 100. It's a line drive to center. He's out in the paddock area with just one man to beat. Goal! Sixteen hundred men dead, and no one knew of their fate. None survived. This was the story of the charge of the Light Brigade. Tune in next week for more of their adventures. It lives in Viscera, and you are the focus. It wants chaos. This dude's like a freaking radio. Okay, that was weird. That was that was weird. I don't feel right. In oh. my head. I think I'm not alone. Off you go. Just like that. Alright, so let me get this straight. He says he lives in a big mansion kind of place. Right. I he think he's the one. Mansion, he's not the one. From the eyes are too close together. Sounded no. more like a penthouse. He said Come on! Him and his Tell me something! Fancy Anything! Hairdo, we're working on a plan to escape there. this place disguised as a band-aid. Yeah! But we're not sure if we can pull it off! Thanks for nothing. Hey! Hey, you! Who, me? No, not you, asshole. Him, the one with the hair. I don't think he likes us. I don't like him either. These are clearly the darkness arms well, talking to me right here. here. Make sure you come back to get us! Unless it's through a wormhole or something. Don't be stupid. Only a worm could fit through a wormhole. Well, he's got a point there. But I'm fairly certain you can create a black hole. Meanwhile, you can rip through the space-time continuum. Ha-ha! Yeah, you guys will be alright. This guy, however... This guy is nothing. Hey, Tommy boy, how you doing? Tony, 
please. Tell me you know what the fuck is going on here. Lima beans are spies. Fuck me. Hey, got any fruit? Alright, screw this. What do you guys got to say? Anything? Clearly not. Ah, I see. Jackie, Dr. James is looking for you. He wants to talk to you. It's okay, you're not in any trouble. Just go see him in his office. Oh, I don't like the look of that. Frank. Frank, I'm so sorry about Eddie. Oh, you mean Edward? He's right over there waiting by Dr. James's office. Go on over there, all right? Hey, pigtails. So let's say you live in a big house and you own some books. I mean, some other fuck nuts might live at the North Pole and they own a lawnmower. But that don't mean nothing. Why would someone in the North Pole have a lawnmower? That's just pointless. When the hell are you ever going to get grass? Oh, Dr. James Jimmy. is waiting, Jackie. Jackie, come on in. I'd hoped I'd see you this morning. Please, have a seat. Okay. I don't know where this is going, but it... Now I know this ain't real. <laughs> no fucking way you're a doctor. I've heard from your nurse that you're getting worried about your medication again. Do you understand why you take the medicine, Jack? I'm not crazy. This is just an illusion. If you know it's an illusion, you could make it go away. But we've had this discussion before. You can't make it go away. Because it is not an illusion. Don't you see what's happening, Jimmy? The darkness is inside our heads! You mean the voice you hear, Jackie? The one that makes you do bad things? Does that seem reasonable to you? Look, I'm not going to skirt around the issue any longer. Skirt? Dr. Vic and I are concerned that you're making up new rules as you go along. Mafia fiction's fine for television, but not for real life. You're not the head of a crime family, Jackie. You're a patient in this institution, and we're trying to help you get well. There is something wrong with this place. You're not keeping okay. me here. Let's just stay chill. Dr. James is trying to help you. Eddie, shut the fuck up! Jackie, I know you're upset, but I'd like you to use your quiet voice now. Her <laughs> quiet voice. I no longer wish to speak to your darkness voice. Fine. Let me out of here. I gotta take a walk. All right. Nobody's stopping you. Edward, take ah, a seat, Miss it. Jenny. Come on, Jackie. Just try to stay calm, Jackie. I know it's yeah. Sure. Whatever you say, Doc. Damn it, I hit space bar. It could have been something I missed. What do you want to say? Oh, you're gonna you're gonna block me away, eh? What ah, oh, I can't jump. I can't sprint. What a ripoff. Sure, you're just gonna stand there and look dumb. You got anything new, Mr. Television Radio? Clearly not. I know it. I'm so glad you're back on your med cycle. It's a very positive sign. Let's see where this one goes, shall we? Dr. Vic's been asking me about your progress. He's very concerned for you. We all are. Jenny, I don't know what this place is, but I'm gonna get us out of Why here. Why would I want to get out of here, Jackie? I work here. I'm here to help you. Is it just me, or is everyone's hands no, extremely you red? Not you two! What the fuck is happening? Just stay calm, Jackie. It's going to be alright. Why does it look like everyone's been digging talked, through blood? You telling me about the delusions you've been having? You said you were the head of a mob family, and that your house was... under attack by men trying to steal the darkness from that you? That wasn't a delusion. That just happened. I know it did. I know it feels real, Jackie, but it's... Jenny, you gotta listen to me. I think this might be hell, and we're trapped here. I'm gonna get us out. I can see why it seems like hell to you sometimes, but it's just a hospital. I want you to trust me. If this was a hospital, Everyone people would be answering their damn phones. Help. I don't know why this is happening, Jenny. You were dead. I saw you die. We talked about this, remember? When you don't take your medicine, you have a hard time separating fiction from reality. You get a lot of bad dreams when your serotonin's out of whack. 
It makes you think you're remembering things that never happened. But my family, my, my friends, the darkness. Jackie, none of this is real. But someone answer the fucking phone. Dr. Vic. Play your cards right and we can see a lot of each other, okay? Jackie, you okay? No, no Stretch one's answering the damn what? phone. Jenny, you don't understand. You're in real trouble. We both are. We're getting out of here. Now! Jackie, whoa, no. whoa, big guy. Code white! <coughs> Easy, Jackie. <coughs> Let go oh, of me! God. Come on. You are ah. doing right, so Alright, here we good. go. Easy, easy. Calm down, Jackie. We're not gonna hurt you. Well, Keep turn these fucking lights off. Oh, really? You're not gonna hurt me, eh? Johnny, cut it out. Finally! Johnny, what Two. the hell are you doing? Sweet. Get them all, would you please? Smash the lights! Smash the lights and we'll be free! Head for the bunker! He must Eva, I be Avoid the orderlies. We'll destroy the lights and I'll be free! Jackie, get back. That is shit. This way. There's nothing out Whee! there for you. Yes, there is. There's darkness. That's exactly what I want. See, as long as the bloodline continues, the darkness will always have a new host. Found that out my fifth birthday. Woke up in the middle of the night with my dad just sitting on my bed, hovering over me. Butcher knife in his hand. <laughs> Still not really sure if the crazy fuck was thinking of putting me out of my misery. I'm making sure no one else will take his place. Strange. Stop, Jackie. Jack, Jesus. I can't believe it. You're back. You said the dark was going to die, but I, I never believed you. It took it four days to repair you after you got shot in the face. Oh, those are my fucking mind. 